Singer Ruby Giang is an alternative singer signed to Chocolate City Music. She visited our studios recently and we got her talking about a genre of music, latest project and what it's like at a record label. That's on Spotlight. I got a good man, oh, 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 a good man, a good man, a good man. Shout out to my baby, yeah, 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 shout out to my baby. I got a good man, oh, ever since the day he's met me. My music genre is called soul R&B. Um, I mix it up with a lot of things: tribal house, reggae, high life, hip hop. You know anything basically that goes with soul or R&B. Um, my influences are Aretha Franklin, Mira Makeba, Mary J. Blige, Whitney Houston, um, Bob Marley. You know I have quite a few, and um, I am in this industry what is called an alternative artist in that I do music that is different from the mainstream sound. Shout out to my baby He said he never gonna need me to Shout out to my baby Whatever comes, he's gonna see me through Shout The thing about Afropop is that almost everybody, like 90% or 95% of the artists are doing that. So for, so for those of us, you know, and like for me who is doing alternative, it's easier for us to stand out. Now we might not be getting the noise, you know, the hype that the mainstream artists are getting yet, but it's it's getting there. So I am a fool for loving you so. Now that I don't have where to go, you show me who you really are. No, let shit now only today. You feel I, should be I think that it's the fact that it's just a sound that has been there for so long. It's a sound that they have paid attention to, you know. But um, I think with the alternative music, because we've not gotten the same amount of noise. You know, most people, are, they want to go with what everyone seems to be doing and it seems to be the Afropop thing. So they have not given us a chance yet to showcase ourselves, but it's changing. I'm signed to Chocolate City. Mm. I used to be on Lupin Music, which was MI's label, but then when he moved over to Chocolate City, he combined both labels. So I'm with Chocolate City now. I have an EP called This Is Love, which is about to drop real soon. On it, I have Nito C, um, Neka, Bess, and Ajabota22. Presently, though, I have some singles out off of the CBN project, which was the compilation album. Of, um, of all the Chocolate City artists, so I have two singles, No More Featuring Jesse Jags and Loose Soul with DJ K. What I love about Chocolate City is if you're showing up, you get your chance at bat. You know, if you've worked hard and the boss is around you, they will come behind you and push you everything they have. So really, there's a chance for everyone. It's just your hustle, you know, your grind that will determine how fast you advance in the label. Um, they need to look out for, like I said before, my EP, This Is Love, and also my events coming up. Just watch out for that. If your money 